friends, Mia here. Today I'm here with my family and where we're going to today is Lazy Dog Restaurant. We've been invited by Lazy Dog to come in and preview the restaurant which is opening next week, July 25th in Kissimmee, Florida. Let me tell you a little bit about Lazy Dog Restaurants. The founder of Lazy Dog Restaurants envisioned a place where you can go with your family and you would feel like you were in the Stony Mountains, somewhere um, secluded where there would be a lodge and you would go in and all the ingredients would be fresh and made to order. If you don't know Lazy Dog, Lazy Dog Restaurants allows you to bring your dog. Now, you have to sit outside on the patio, but the waitress will bring you a menu where you and your dog can select something special for that dog to have and you can eat out there with the dog as well. So this is what the restaurant looks like from the exterior and there's Ricky and my husband so we're gonna go in and um, see what they're offering today. Look at the wood chandelier. Guys, this is gorgeous. Ricky is really excited because in California it was one of his favorite places. And look at everybody. Hi! There's the bar area. And here's the inside of the restaurant and we'll go on the patio in a little while. They also have their own line of beer. So you can take some beer home. We don't drink anymore, but uh, this is it. It looks really cool. It looks like if you're going fishing, you can just pick this up and go into the mountains fishing. Here's some of the artwork. And now we're gonna head on the patio. There's the paw print. This area here is where you can dine with your dog. This is the menu for drinks. So I don't see the dog menu, but there is one. And this is what the patio looks like. Surprisingly, it's really cool out there. I wouldn't mind staying out there at all. So um, you guys, you dog lovers, you want to bring your dog here? I'm telling you, perfect. The patio's perfect. Here's an amazing work of art with the dog here. This is amazing. And he has Sabrina in a heart. We do, yes. <laughs> wow, that is amazing. I love it. And there's the fam. So Rick, you were saying the menu? Yes, it's a special menu for today. So you get to choose one drink per person from the list. Starters, you get to choose one starter or one dessert for the table to share. You choose one salad for the table to share. And you can choose one house favorite, such as burgers, per person. Cool! Desserts, you get one starter or one dessert for the table. Okay, so for starters, we're going to start off with mocktails because we don't drink. They are offering uh, alcoholic beverages today. Uh, here on the menu, um, so we are not getting alcohol because we don't drink, so we're going to get mocktail drinks. Ricky got a strawberry uh, lemonade, uh, let's see, hold on here, so, strawberry citrus soda, and um, I got the um, Jamaican lemonade, and my husband got a mixture, it's not on the menu, it's a mixture of pineapple and coconut and something else. Oh wow, well, 
he polished it off. What are you trying, Rick? Coconut pineapple aqua fresh. Okay. Let's see how that tastes. Very good. Yeah? I guess it's my turn. I'm gonna try the strawberry uh, Jamaican lemonade. Here we go. Oh my goodness. This is delicious and let me tell you, if it had a little rum in it, it would be better. Except I don't drink. I used to drink. I don't drink anymore. I never drank a lot. I've never been a drinker. But sometimes I would have a drink with a meal if I went out. But uh, not anymore. But if you do drink really rum in here, it would be awesome. Now I have to ask the waitress, why are they ringing the cowbell? I don't remember that happening in the other ways of dog. I don't know if it's a new thing. So I'm going to find out why they're ringing that bell. Hey Rick, you want to try the coconut shrimp? Dad, you can help yourselves. It's so good, isn't it? Huge. Oh, Ricky takes off the tail. I know, Ricky, the tail. Put it on the plate, honey. There you go. <laughs> Very zesty, right? Oh, the sauce? Can you tell us what the sauces were again? Yep, absolutely. There is a red jalapeno hot sauce, a low sodium citrus soy, a molasses barbecue, and then an IPA infused mustard. The IPA infused mustard is actually an IPA brewed in house too. It's gonna be the liquid blanket IPA. Wonderful, thank you. Look at this, Look at this you guys. Huge. Ricky, 
Wait, what do you have there? What is that? Ricky, Ricky, look at the camera. What, is, what do you have to eat? What is that? What is it, Ricky? Cheeseburgers plain? Yeah? Burger cheese and bun? Ricky, is it good? Thumbs up or down? Yeah, you love your cheeseburgers. And Ricky also has fries and onion rings. So my husband, he has the fried chicken dinner with the mashed potatoes and vegetable. See the spiced maple syrup right here. And there's the gravy. Okay, and the spinach and the mashed potatoes. My food is Korean style. It has meat, vegetables, and an egg in it. So there's a bunch of uh, vegetables in here. There are sprouts, carrots, zucchini. I see there's spinach. I'm just excited to taste this. And I'm going to use one of the sauces here, which is a soy sauce, right on top of the meat. Yeah. Is it like you remember it, Rick? It's a little different, right, from the other lazy dog? A little different. Yeah? Um, I didn't have it with the maple syrup or the rice. I didn't have the plain chicken cutlet. Uh, they're bigger and flatter. They're bigger and flatter? I got double portions. He's saying that in California, he used to get double portions of the meal, but it's a little bit different there, or it was at the time, because it's been about... I don't know, about eight years since we've been there? So yeah, seven, eight years. Seven, eight years since we've been to Lazy Dog. But check that out. That looks so good. And Ricky, well, burger's gone, and he is on his onion ring here. He loves onion rings. And I'm sure those fries are nice and crispy. Oh my God, they are crispy, you guys. Check this out, watch. I don't know if you guys heard it snap up. Oh, Ricky just took it out of my hand. So let me try my meal and I'll let you know how the Korean barbecue is. Okay, here we go. Just the meat. Oh my goodness, it's yummy. Oh, and there's rice in here too. Let me try some of the rice with the vegetables and the meat all together.
Oh, I need to have some of this. Hold on one second here, you guys. It's okay. I have to get some of the ice cream, the pie, and the crust all together because this is a la mode. for the Habitat for Humanity. Check out this horse. Yeah, it's made out of branches and um, locks. Okay. Combination lock. What's the Chevrolet? What is that? Just a uh, logo? An emblem from the car. Okay. Cool. So did everybody enjoy Lazy Dog today? We sure did. Looking forward to coming back? We are. All right, thumbs up? Thumbs up. Thumbs up, thumbs up. All right, you guys, thank you for hanging with us today. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you'll come and visit Lazy Dog Cafe if you have one in your area. Comment below and let us know what you think of Lazy Dog. As a family, we will see you in the next vlog. Very soon. Real soon, bye everybody.